The goldfish is a freshwater fish in the family Cyprinidae. Carasus oridus is the scientific name of goldfish. The goldfish is a relatively small member of the carp family. It was first selectively bred for color in China more than 1,000 years ago. Goldfish kept in bowls or many aquariums suffer from death, disease, and stunting, due primarily to the low oxygen and very high ammonia-slash-nitrite levels inherent in such an environment. Goldfish require high levels of oxygen and they produce a large amount of waste. Good aeration and filtration systems are essentials for goldfishes. In Chinese history, goldfish was seen as a symbol of luck and fortune. It is considered as a lucky fish as per feng shui. In China, during olden days, only members of the Song dynasty could own goldfish. Goldfish excavate the gravel when searching for food, which makes it difficult to establish plants. If plants are planted in goldfish aquarium, protect the plants by securing them in place with rocks. Shavunkans and other certain goldfishes root around in the aquarium substrate, sucking in and spitting out pieces of gravel. This is their normal behavior and they do it to find edible items. Goldfishes have the ability to distinguish between individual humans. When owners reach near to the tank, they react favorably to them like swimming to the front of the glass, swimming rapidly around the tank, and going to the surface, mouthing for food. They are aggressive eaters and may often show begging behavior for food, when they saw their owners. At the same time, they may hide when other people approach the tank. It is possible to keep three or more different varieties of goldfish together in a single tank, without difficulty. But it is best to avoid mixing exotic goldfish variants with general type goldfishes since such goldfishes were bred for their looks rather than their swimming ability, and may lose out to their more agile relatives in competition for food. This can lead to stunted growth or possible starvation. Avoid red or blue gravel for goldfish tanks. White, brown, black or pale colored gravel or pebbles are ideal choice for a goldfish tank, providing a striking contrast to the fish's vivid colors, otherwise their coloration appears dull. Goldfishes are egg layers. Most goldfish breed in captivity, generally in ponds. Males chase female goldfish and prompt them to release their eggs by bumping and nudging them. Their eggs are adhesive and attached to aquatic plants, typically dense plants such as kabamba or a spawning mop. The eggs hatch within 48 to 72 hours. But artificial breeding methods are adopted for exotic type of goldfishes. Certain types of goldfishes can reach up to a size of 10 to 16 inches. As per BBC, largest goldfish in the world was believed to be 19 inches. Growth and size of the goldfish is decided by tank size, water conditions, know of fishes per volume, quality foods, genetics, and health conditions. They can attain large sizes in ponds than fish tanks. In Oranda goldfish, head growth known as the hood or when is normally restricted to the top of the head, extending back over the eyes and it has dorsal fin too. Even though Oranda and lion head look similar in first impression, they can be distinguished easily since the absence of a dorsal fin is a key feature of the lion head. Goldfish have schooling behavior, and like to be in groups. Very rarely does a goldfish harm another goldfish. Once established in an aquarium, goldfishes behave without shy and fear. Best tank mates of goldfishes are Rosy Barb, Zebra Danio, Giant Danio, Corydoras, Platy, Placos etc.
The tail lobes of butterfly goldfish, when extended and viewed from above, resemble the wings of a butterfly. Whereas in veil tail goldfish, the long caudal fin of the veil tail is fully divided, so that it hangs down in folds. The dorsal fin is tall, and in a well-proportioned veil tail it should match the height of the body. For fish foods and pet essentials, visit our website www.richbay.in.